It is the Zach Sang Show. We got Heather. We Hi. got Dan. We got Liz Gillies. Hello. And we also have Matt Bennett in the back corner. <laughs> I just, I didn't want to, hey, I didn't want to come on the show. I've been feeling kind of anxious lately, and so it helps for me to kind of bring an emotional support um, animal. We got to get him a vest, though. <laughs> I don't want, I actually, I'm happy. With, we, I, we were both going to wear um, silk pajamas today, so he's wearing a silk pajama shirt. It's nice. It's so, a, so there's no confusion. It's his equivalent of like an orange vest on a plane understood. for the animals. <laughs> he's a service. He's a service. Um, I, uh, yep. It's yep. nice that you're wearing uh, pajamas and it's like 90 degrees in the studio right now. Yeah, I thought that it would be air conditioned, but I guess new studio doesn't mean new. <laughs> new everything. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> everything else. In I like this for the couch. So I feel very much like I feel like you're a little Howard Stern. It's very, it's very nice. <laughs> you hated it for the first, you know, moments, but well, you're getting used to it. You you know, like that. Do you know Halloween Town? You know, like I think it's Halloween Town too, where they have to like go in front of like the the jury of people, and they're all in the courthouse, and they're like, I like they're. I know. Do you know what I'm talking about? I know what you're talking about. Yeah, that's what it feels like right now. I'm really nervous. I get to talk to Matt the whole time. He's behind. Me. <laughs> <laughs> like, does he want to come sit here? Does he no, want to come I'll, say hello? I'll let him come when it's time. It's yeah, time, yeah, but he has oh, okay. to stay on the floor. Yes. But and crouch. <laughs> Neil. Okay, that's good. <laughs> good compromise. Hey, congratulations on Dynasty. Thank you. Yeah. Come on, that's huge. Let's big deal. We, ha- we, <laughs> must, let, we have to celebrate. Let's oh, I just have woo! to have champagne oh. here. Yeah. By that's the way, so funny. Did anyone it's like <laughs> where'd you come up with that idea? <laughs> or, or did I tell you I wanted to drink the next time I came? <laughs> wow! oh, oh, that was not expected. Wow. That was too quick. Uh, was, was it too quick? That's what she said. Yep. <laughs> that release He was, wouldn't know. So. Wow, that just Was that your start. first time popping champagne? Dude, like, I just, I, but usually, like, it's in there, and you, it, it takes a little bit of nudging before it pops. That's what and, she said. Yeah, and this just <laughs> Again, he wouldn't exploded. know. Wow. Okay. All right, yeah. well, pour it. Let's get on Congratulations on Thank Dynasty. You. Seriously, Thank come on. Thank you. How you feeling? I'm excited. I leave, uh, I leave very soon to go do that. Uh, yeah. It's going to be fun. You're going to be in Atlanta. That's yeah. where you're shooting. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm literally going for the summer months into the fall, which I think tornado season starts back up in the fall. Perfect. We shot during tornado season, which uh, for me... This is your worst nightmare. Well, I'm happy to, I'm happy to, I'm happy to be working. I'm excited about the show. It, <laughs> I'm, and Atlanta's really fun. There is great food. I'm very afraid of weather, so... <laughs> it's not a match made in heaven, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to show up. <laughs> I, I, I feel like... Fallon is a perfect role for you. Yeah. Like, what what went through your mind when you first read the pilot? Well, I um had appendicitis. <laughs> <laughs> I'm actually not kidding. I had appendicitis and I was in the hospital. Oh. Um, I know I can't reference him again, but Matt was with me in the hospital because no one else, <laughs> no one else believed me. So I told Matt to come down to the ER, and then I did have appendicitis, and they took uh, they took that baby out, and then I woke <laughs> up and I I had this email of of Dynasty, and I was still kind of on lots of of drugs and I and I and I read it and I was like that would be fun so I went and I I right out of the like two days after recovery I, went oh and I read God. for that Zach yeah, watching no. you do this is such a disaster Jesus. I just spilled it everywhere oh, sorry God. <laughs> sorry you tell like a story sorry okay it's fine it's not you're, interesting you're, no, whatever no, I had a pe- I had my no. appendix out and then I did and then I did the I got the audition and then I, the same week I think they they told me in the you, room which had never happened before but how do you process Fallon like w- what goes to your mind like how do you dissect her because she is complex yeah I well the original mm. Fallon was kind of she was wonderful and I watched a lot of the original Dynasty before, because I don't want people to hate me. Like, we're remaking something, and whenever you remake something, you do a reboot, there's a really good chance that the the, the OGs, the people who grew up with it, are going to be like, oh, and they're going to roll their eyes. And so my goal is to create a character that pays... I want to pay tribute to her and homage to her, but I want to recreate it so that it's not a direct comparison, because, I mean, people... We're in love with the original characters, you know? It, 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 diehards of yes, Dynasty. Yes, yes. Like yes. our parents, their grandparents. Yes. Like my mom's obsessed. Yeah. She's very excited. She should be on the show. Hey, guys, for people like me, what is Dynasty? Zach? I can explain. Okay. <laughs> okay. So, I have no idea. So pretty much it's like two, the original was two families that were super wealthy, right? Yep. Kind of competing against each other. Yes. But the, what I've been able to dissect just off of the big trailer that was released right. was that this is kind of different, right? Yes. Fallon and, and you you have a brother and you have a super rich dad, right? Yes. They own a family company and your dad wants Oil, to, energy. Oil, energy. They want to, uh, he wants, wants to bring in a new woman and get, get married. He has a girlfriend, right? Yes, and which is very, which he always has new girlfriends and he always has new women coming to the house. All I want is not only for my father to love me, but I want his respect. I want to be taken seriously. I want to inherit the company. I want to run the company one you day. You want she to be to the be a, COO. She wants to be a boss bitch, and she yeah. can. Nice. And I think the original Fallon wanted that as well, but I would say that for the women in our show, for Crystal and I, 
uh, we, we've really kicked up the ambition to uh, to fit this generation, to fit the times now versus then. They kind of were kind of okay just being wives and, you know, just yeah. ladies back then. And now we definitely have a lot that we want to do. Now, is Crystal's family rich too? Or? No, not at all. Crystal comes from Crystal comes from nothing. She works for Blake, for uh, for. Blake Carrington, and then he takes a liking to her, and they end up, you know, having. I, I walk in on them basically, yeah. uh, which I realize I've done in like every show. <laughs> I guess not victorious, but that's like my, my walking in on a parent having sex face is like it's almost like it's on autopilot now. I've done it so many times, not in real life. I've never done it in real life. Uh, imagine? No, I don't want to imagine. Okay, It'd be horrible. George um, and Lori. No, stop. George and Lori. That's my brother. Oh and my, my god. Mom. <laughs> <laughs> I have to go. <laughs> What's wrong with you? I'm a little off, George man. and Lori. No, that's... My 21 year old brother and my mother. <laughs> it's getting hot in here. Is it though? No. It should. It should, it should be. be. <laughs> We're sweating because it's already hot and I'm a little nervous. <laughs> wow. Anyway. Holy. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you haven't changed. What are we bit. talking about? I don't know. So, <laughs> okay, so basically, I, I I think it's going to be just another uh, lady, but then they surprise us with a wedding, oh. and that's when we fight because you have to fight in Dynasty. And uh, so she's now a huge obstacle, and he's putting her in front of me, which is even a bigger insult. And so her, my character's her whole thing. This show centers around the feud, really, between. Crystal and Fallon. In mm-hmm. the original, it was more so between Crystal and Alexis, who enters, who was Joan Collins. Yeah. Who, I, I don't know mm-hmm. who will play that role, but my God. I've inherited a lot of that character, and my my role is almost a, a hybrid, I, I believe, of the original Alexis and, and Fallon. So, what was, was Fallon the daughter in the original? Yeah, she was the daughter. Yeah. So, I mean, this is, it, it's the same, but different. It's the same, but different, yeah. I mean, listen, if you watch the original Dynasty, I mean, it's, it's fabulous, but it was very much of that time. You'll yeah. listen to things they say, and you're like, oh, that could never be said now. You know, we have to kind of modernize it and update it, and we have. And it's set in Atlanta. It was set in Denver. Oh, cool. So, it has a fun, young... You know me. <laughs> Keep it young. Dude, and, and you have two love interests, right, that play against yeah. each other. Sh- yeah. First scene in the big Can't trail. Can't have one. No, obviously. Come, no. It's, you know. Your first scene, you're getting, like, uh, pleasured by the person who picks you up. Hey, your, now. Your driver. Someone just woke up. <laughs> <laughs> now we're talking. Um, yeah, that was fun to shoot. Yeah, but what, okay, so what is that like when it's time to shoot that scene? Like, but, like what is he actually doing I mean, that's there? mild. I had to do more intense but I've never done that. Yeah. I've never done like we open and Liz, it's tight on your like potato face from like your chin <laughs> to your forehead. It. And it's just like, it's like face from Nickelodeon except paler with redder lips. And I'm just like, oh, I just knew what it looked like. And I didn't know what level to do. Do you know what I mean? It's so awkward. I, so you're, I really, didn't know to, you know, you're faking like, an oh. orgasm. Uh huh. Do I mean, it right now. Do you- I was going to say something, but it would be too. <laughs> Let's see what you got. I'm not doing that now. I still have a family. Uh, th- when they're all gone, I'll come on the show and I'll do it for three hours. <laughs> your family's, according to Zach, your family is freaky, so. Um, yeah. <laughs> He's imagining my brother and my mother I sleeping know. together. But what is it like when you're shooting that scene, though? Like, what is he doing down there? How is he killing time? Like, or are you doing it separate? Like, yeah, is- he has Jenga. <laughs> <laughs> He's like... Just he has, like, a Scrabble. Playing Candy Crush? Yeah, yeah he's spinner. playing Candy Crush. No, no. Rob is really cool. Oh, this is the craziest. So Rob, who plays Colhane, who's the limo driver who Fallon uh, sleeps with. Who also does your who dirty work. she loves, work. too. But, but he does your dirty work. He does work. my dirty work, too. I yeah. send him, and I'm like, get a picture. Mm-hmm. Follow them. And he's, like, on it. And then he shows me, and then I'm like, Ugh. And so it's, it's a good relationship. But I, she really, she re- they really care for each other because... He's he's known her since she was young, which is kind of interesting too if you think about it. But no, I mean they he understands her, and so she's open and she's more vulnerable with him than Jeff, who she's trying to she's she's not trying to use Jeff, but she's trying she she wants to do business with him, and it will benefit their company and her career if she if she schmoozes him a little bit and flirts with him and gets on his good side. So the calling is a more as of right now, authentic, natural. Organic relationship, and, but yes, when we're, he's very nice, Rob. And this, this, so far, that's the only one we've had that was <laughs> like that. We we're in a very tight limo. It was a hot Atlanta day. Oh, oh. Uh, yeah, it was. Um, yep, 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 yep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I it's mean, fine. It's how fine. do you prepare for that? Like, do you do you do you, you practice? Yeah, I sit in my hotel room. <laughs> I just stare <laughs> in the mirror and practice. No, <laughs> I go to work and I do it. Okay. Well, okay. I have a pillow fight in underwear with myself, and then I do that. Like, what do you think? I don't. Like, she's a professional. For it. Also, while that's happening, your brother is hooking up with your new Mom. stepmoms. Mom. No, your brother in the show, Fallon's brother, yeah. is hooking up with your new stepmom's nephew. Yeah. 
It's very, everybody's mm-hmm. sleeping with everybody. Yeah, it's all over the place. It has to be. It's created by the people who did Gossip Girl. They're mm-hmm. the ones executive producing and Josh running and it. Stephanie. They're- Josh Schwartz and Stephanie Savage. And I'm such a big Gossip Girl fan, and I'm such a big OC fan. They did both of them. And so there were some shots that when I was watching the pilot that just looked like establishing shots, like before Blair and, Ser- Blair and S- Serena walk in. I'm like slurring from like two sips of champagne from this room temperature. <laughs> <laughs> I'm assuming cheap champagne. Uh-huh. Warm, kidding. too. It's nice. I just watched the beginning of that trailer. <laughs> oh, had you not seen it? No. Oh. Well, it's a good time to watch it wow. right now. It was a great time to watch it. <laughs> Dude, it, it, what are you, your thoughts on it? Do you see what I mean about the tight shot, though? Like, it's not the most flattering angle we could have picked. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> wow. Anyway. Okay. Thanks, Dan. I don't even remember your question. Uh, <laughs> we're talking about, okay, the people, who, <laughs> the people who created the show, they're the yeah. best in the business, and they're best at, like, putting a, uh, doing yeah. a show like this. Yeah. Well, like, shooting the pilot with them, what'd you learn? Did you learn anything new being on set? It was great. I mean, I really felt I, I, I was so excited to work with them again. I was such a big fan of both the shows. And I think the energy, it has the same feeling, that same underlying uh, exciting feeling that when I was a kid and I watched, not even a kid, like I was, I'll still rewatch yeah. Gossip Girl with the OC now because I love it so much. People it, binge it. Yeah. And I think this show is going to have the same feeling. And I know that I think my fans are super excited for it. They kind of had to take one for the team with the last show. It was kind of set for an older audience, yeah. but they, they grooved with it. So this is much more their demo and but I, I think there's something in it for everybody and these characters aren't in high school you know I think my characters are like 24 25 and everyone's an adult living their life and so it really spans a wide age gap which the is nice the fashion's amazing um, I had a four oh. hour fitting yesterday how that must uh, have been so much fun oh my god it was ridiculous it was ridiculous it's made me a snob. Like, I don't dress like this every day. I did this kind of as a joke. But I, yeah, it's the clothes are just incredible. Incredible. So, okay. I want to get into Pamela Sue Martin. She originally played Fallon mm-hmm. on Dynasty. Do you reach out to her? Does um, anyone connect you with her? I haven't yet. I should, right? Maybe. Well, she sends me a death threat. <laughs> She's like, good luck. XOXO. PSM. <laughs> no, I should. I don't know. I like the low-key middle finger, too, in one of the shots. That was funny. They didn't use that in the pilot, but they, they did release that picture today. I was sweating so much, and there were so many bugs. That day, and every time a bee came around, I would run away. So that's why I didn't look good in that picture. Not that I'm making excuses. But what was my animal doing? That. <laughs> okay. Matt was just in New Mexico with me. Ooh. Where are you? You were also in the hospital. Yeah, I was in the hospital again. Did I, yeah, yeah, I went to the hospital a lot this year. Yeah, I'm I was really, worried. I have really bad luck. I got a horrible stomach virus the night Matt was coming in to visit me in New Mexico. I was working on this thing, and I was like, Matt, come visit me. And he's like, for sure, we're going to do this, we're going to do that, we're going to drive to Santa Fe. And I was like, let's open up a restaurant in Santa Fe. <laughs> and we were like so excited. And then I got a horrible stomach virus. Had to be rushed to the ER. And I had fluids. It was a whole moment. <laughs> but the fluids help. They do help. He took like, he described it as tablespoons of blood. What? Yeah, what? He took- yeah. D- didn't? Do you mind if I invite my animal in yeah, for just yeah, two yeah. minutes? Yeah, of course. Yeah. It just helps for the for this part of the interview. Come on in. You can walk faster. <laughs> it's so cute, you guys. Oh, you got zebras on your pajamas. Yeah. This was just a. You look good. You can uh, grab that mic if you grab want. Grab that mic. Grab that mic. This one? Yeah, That's yeah, it, yeah. Man. <laughs> That's the one. Come, baby. How do you're on? Are we like on? Is the shot wide enough? No, you're good. <laughs> I'm sure not. But oh just. god! So tell him about what the uh, what the hospital man said to you, Mr. Hosp- Mr. Mr. Hospital, hospital man. man. I said, Mr. Hospital Man, please don't take too much blood. I haven't had much to eat. I feel like I'm gonna faint. And he said, right. He said, I'll be careful. If you faint, I'm gonna have to cut your clothes off. Oh he said, god. Remember what? No, he said, Remember what Grandma said. <laughs> the guy says, Hey, remember what Grandma said? Always wear clean underwear because if you faint, I'm gonna have to cut your clothes off. Whoa! And, and, I was like, and then he goes. He goes. Happen? But don't then, th- don't think you're going to get out of this hospital without somebody recognizing you. Yes. We know who you are. So he recognized oh me, God. and then talked hey. about cutting my clothes off. I thought it was hilarious. Yeah. Was and he, then she he, was very uncomfortable <laughs> with it. I thought it was it was it was equally part. And then I was like, Oh, does this whole bag have to finish? I'd love to get out of here. And he's like, Oh, you want to get out of here? I want to get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> was he attractive? I don't want to like. I feel bad. It, what if I'm? What if I'm? He's there not again? our type. All right. He's not our type. <laughs> he's not my type. Okay. I'm, you know, committed. Matt's committed to the Lord. <laughs> we can't. It's not. How, how many times do I have to do this? It's one. Just one? Okay. Yeah. Now you're out of it. You went out. You were in and then was, you came out. I was raised somewhere in the middle. Yeah. I was, you know, I've, we were, I've, we were I've raised like, yeah, Christian, I, but we definitely celebrated. I've, I've, I've like lit a menorah and hung an ornament at your house. Yeah, man. That's what I'm talking about. Sometimes you want to sip, sip the sweet nectar? Yeah, I was going to ask, what is this, Corbell? <laughs> yes. <laughs> it, 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 oh, it is. It's one yeah. step above Andre, yeah. Mm. Come on. 
Chris, um, it's so dry. We saw an open house. Th- that's fun. We went to an open house. We, did. we pretended to be like, I'll take that back now. We pretended to be <laughs> um, like buying a house. And she's like, oh, you're Hollywood people. She's like, in that case, follow me. Like she thought we had like money. We're gonna buy a house. <laughs> and I was like, the bathroom's them. a little small, Matt. And you're like, it's small. And she's like, wait, wait, let me show you the backyard. And we're like, oh, you want us back. We were just <laughs> with her. Um, that was fun. New Mexico yeah, just else? killing it. We went to Meow Wolf. Went to Meow Wolf. What's Meow Wolf? Meow Wolf is this crazy thing. They should have one in LA. It's like yeah. this crazy art exhibition. Interactive. You walk through. It starts. It's like a an abandoned, uh, what do you call it? Laser tag. Mm. That's what I guess it was. Because it's a cool. big cavernous. And they built a house inside of it. Ooh. Two floors. And you walk through the refrigerator. It takes it out of space. Yeah. You go through the washing machine. Mm-hmm. It takes you through a wormhole. What? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I can't yeah. hard to explain. It's like an acid trip. They should have this here. It would be so... It, would be, it wouldn't be as special if it was here, though. And because, it's, you know, it's not So many Mexico. photo ops. Yeah. Uh, Albuquerque, I, you know, I haven't been yet, but I like the community of Albuquerque. They're good people there. They really How are. How do you know? We <laughs> haven't the, been there. Well, we talk to them every night. We're on the radio there. Oh, hi, Albuquerque. Yeah, KKOB. <laughs> Albuquerque. <laughs> no, there's her, a song. Uh, I played her the Weird Al Yankovic Albuquerque. There's a Neil, Neil Young. I actually it was really sad. I was I was really bored when I was in Albuquerque. I was I, not like I, Albuquerque is amazing. I was just uh-huh. in the wrong part. I was downtown with a lot of homeless men. Um, <laughs> They're very anyway, sweet. Really, they're sweet. <laughs> very interesting sweet, sweet homeless, homeless community there. Yeah. I don't have a problem with homeless men. These were really. Ad- I've never known this. Type this breed of homeless men. Sure, it's so always what, different everywhere so you go. What was the New Mexico breed of homeless so men? So Matt like encountered a whole different vibe than than we did when we were there. We were kind of my cast that I was with. We yeah. it was more like very aggressive, scary, murderous. Oh. Middle of the night, walk into the hotel like neck hanging off, like eyeball falling neck out. Hanging off? Matt was like, they're so sweet and they're flirty as hell. Like, yes, <laughs> <laughs> I, I encountered you know 2017. Great, uh, a yeah. lot of gay homeless men. Oh, hey. I'm all for it. Yeah. I think that's great. Good, you know, like. Poor guy couldn't get any numbers, though, because they have no phones. <laughs> <laughs> Just, you know, meet me you at the street corner. Nowhere to tether corner. it to. No street address to, t- to tether it to. But I was walking down the street, and, I, you know, there were two homeless people passing a joint around. And just this, I was like, nice. Ooh. I didn't know if it's legal there. So I just, like, looked at them, like, it's not. what are they doing on the street? And they go, Hey, daddy. <laughs> Homes person to me. And I, my, my brain was just it was divided in half. I just went, hi. And I walked away. What? And what? You left. Yeah. See, I, well, I wasn't going to interact. By the way, he interact. was, gone, he was, gone, like, two, he was gone an hour. Like, I don't know what, what the real version of that yeah, story is. Yeah. I, I mean, like, that's, that's complimentary. <laughs> While the two of you are on the couch, mm-hmm. victorious, are we going to be doing a real finale? Boy, I sure hope so. The talk always kind of comes back around. I'll be the one to just say the thing. It's lo- it's looking better than it has in a while. Really? It is? <laughs> Do you know something I don't? You little bitch. <laughs> don't leave me we hanging. We talk about it, you know. I mean, you saw what happened on Twitter. That yeah, was a positive yeah. motion. No, it's, it's That's big. what I'm saying. I what mean, everyone seems Twitter? like they're a- they're willing and able. Well, the yeah. conversation started with Ariana, and then I think Dan chimed in, and then Victoria chimed in, then you guys chimed in, then Leon and Danielle. And I think the thing is, if we can get Ariana Robin, to do it, She's the big get. Then I think that we have I think have she a, really wants she, to do it. She does want to do it. I think it's about timing. I think we all, none of us, we all want to do it. And the network wants it too, I'm sure. Who knows? I, I would, well, Maybe I, they don't want us running around those sets again. Can't, can't, it, can't you guys just say, hey, Ariana, let's do this. And Yay. She, <laughs> hey, Ariana, come on. <laughs> hey, come on. No. <laughs> Take time out of your busy schedule to do, throw a bone to us, little girl. Yeah, man, much going on. It made a finale. <laughs> <laughs> We're all, we all want to do it. That's, I mean, it was cool to see it happen because it does. Like, maybe once a year the conversation kind of comes up in some way. It's nice that it's now concrete. Like, we all kind of uh, sign a little something. Put it out there yeah. to the oh. universe. No, no, no. I mean, I mean, metaf- oh, yeah, yeah. in a way, it's con- we... It's, it's a metaphorical concrete. <laughs> yeah, it's that kind of soft metaphorical <laughs> concrete. Okay. Exactly. I mean, what do you want out of it? Would you want it to be a reunion? Would you want to put, like, a like a, a, like a I don't think period? it what we want, to be honest. I think it'd be great <laughs> if we all graduated Hollywood arts. <laughs> Since we're all in our late mid to late 20s. Yes, exactly. You know, they kind of left us perpetually 16, 17. Yeah. So to have us age out and to yeah. up and go to college, finally. <laughs> yeah. We've been waiting. First, ki- first kiss. I'm sure Dan has a ton of ideas <laughs> well, right now. Well, Beck and Jade have, at this point, I believe, a two-year-old baby. Whoa. It's something I, Avin and I just announced yeah. without asking anybody. <laughs> if there was a timeline, they've definitely got, Jade's definitely pregnant. No, no, no! I have had the baby because I was super pregnant like two Christmases ago. I mean, Jade. Robbie's still saving himself for marriage. (laughs) (laughs) You guys imagine I had like a Freudian slip because I was really pregnant too. I mean, Jade was. (laughs) You're saving yourself for marriage still. Robbie is still saving himself for marriage. While Rex has not long, (laughs) long since. And all the times you had to watch. Exactly. I had. I was. I was an active participant. Real close. (laughs) 
Yeah. Thanks, guys. Maybe Isn't it really great that you guys are still friends? This is adorable. No. Still friends. <laughs> we yeah. are friends. Just, neither, neither one of us we don't have anything better to do. <laughs> Truly, we have nothing better to do. I literally flew him out to see me last week because I had a slow four days. But th- see, that's fun. And it keeps you sane and it keeps you happy. Or does it keep us insane? Uh, I mean, insane but maybe... In keeps us something. The fight scenes in Dynasty. Yes. How much choreography goes into that? Like, how much work? It was a lot. So Natalie and I initially did an eight-minute crazy borderline, like, a little bit, like, a different type of show fight scene. <laughs> Ooh. Bed, floor, Ooh. wall, nice. like it was crazy. Uh, <laughs> your what were you wearing? Ooh! <laughs> the sweats stu- and the sweat stunt man's like windbreaker. It was just the least sexy. <laughs> sweats. They were wearing sweats. Actually, really funny story. Natalie's like super beautiful and ethereal, and she's really hippie-ish. And she and I'm just the opposite. I'm just I just talk, and I, there's no mystery <laughs> with me at all. We know that. And so we did the fight scene. And she was wearing like a free people like like flesh tone onesie and like these cute Ooh. jeans and I was wearing like I like I got prepared like on Nickelodeon we had stunt stuff I was wearing right. like, sweat, like sweatpants <laughs> and like huge sneakers and a sweatshirt and like and I watched the video back and it just looks like she's with like a dude <laughs> stunt guy and I was like oh <laughs> sh- <laughs> that's just a side note so we sent them this eight minute version and it was way too much and we ended up condensing it to what was in the uh what was that your first like real fight scene mm. Mm, I don't know. I've 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 played a lot of bitches who have hit people, so it's like. But this one, this is going to be the most for sure. This is going to be really the most intense. And it's the first of many, I'm sure. Oh, of many, yeah. Dude. They were incredible. If you've seen the original Dynasty, if you Google, the pond is a very memorable one. That's, uh, in in um, that's what they're known they for. Alexis's the studio is incredible. I mean, and they have these stunt guys that are just these huge men that swamp out for these you know dainty <laughs> actresses, and it's incredible because they don't really try to hide it that much. I mean, they're getting thrown through windows, and then they'll cut to John. Collins, she'll be like, <sighs> and she'll look beautiful. She'll be like, oh. but meanwhile, there's just like a dude like picking up the other one and throwing. It's, it's. I'm really excited to be a part of this institution. That face that you made when you grabbed your soon-to-be stepmom's hair. That's the other thing. I have to learn how to fight pretty because I fight like a. I'm like a scrappy boy. We fought. I mean, you know, I can get very into it. Us? Mm-hmm. I mean, yeah, just. And then you go, my wrist. <laughs> Ow, my neck, Ow, my, my neck, ankles. My ankles. She, she's an ankle biter. She bit, bit my ankle. What? No. Are you know. into that? <laughs> Biting? <laughs> What's going on in your, like, where are you right now? Are you single yet? Am I Look single Look at you, yet? drinking champagne, wearing those silky pajamas. You think I'm doing this all for you? Uh-huh. Where are you with, with whatever for, you're into? Uh, waiting for you, Liz. Oh, that's so sad. <laughs> he, he tries to hit on a lot of the guests that come in here. I just watched an interview you did. Which one? The latest one that was just posted. I just clicked one. Madison Beer? Yeah. Uh, oh. Very pretty girl. Dan and Madison. I don't know any of anyone, so I'm just like, has I sound it, like someone's like grandma. Very pretty girl. Has Halsey been back in a while? Uh, yeah, she came back. Uh, oh, I saw her. The lawyer hasn't responded to <laughs> any, of your, any, any of my, uh, I've been trying to contact them, my emails. Okay. And- it hasn't worked <laughs> out yet. I don't think she really knows that it exists. Which? The lawsuit? Uh, the, both. The lawsuit and well, your- you called me the A word, so. Well, you know. That's the A word. Ass. The anus? With, with the A H word. Asshole. Uh, oh, okay. What do you think of her new, what do you think of her new album? A Hopeless Fountain Kingdom? Yeah. <laughs> no. Oh, That's a real name? Yeah. Yep. There's you know <laughs> so much music on it, like tracks and there's at least beat. 10 I bet you there's beats. Beats and just like vocal takes and singing and produ- production value. Does she throw lyrics or I think she throws some lyrics up in the air and you know, juggling them around. Are there drums? Yeah, I don't know much about it. Like, it's a really good album. I like it. I only album is from now that I listened to recently, which I've been really vocal about, like it's embarrassing, is I, Harry Styles' album. He's so good. It's great. A, okay, it's a great so album, good. but do we not feel that parts of that album were obviously stolen from, yeah. you know, previous course, icons? Great. If it's on the radio... Verse, no, I'm, I'm, I'm not preaching to the choir right now, but I feel like if it's if that type of music makes people want to hear other types of music that are super musical like that, and what does it sound like? The Rolling Stones? What's that? Bowie? If kids are doing that instead of being like, you know. I totally get it. Like, it's better that way, don't you think? I totally understand. And him getting on the radio ushers in a whole new sound. He has a beautiful voice. I love that he sang with Stevie Nicks. I don't yes. know. Fine. I'm, thumbs up from me. No, I, I agree. You I, don't have to hate him. No. I give, I like Harry Styles. <laughs> Has he been Styles. on this show? Yes. Mm. No, oh, yeah, yes. On this couch? Not, he, he's bet. called us. 
Uh, oh, he's called you. From, <laughs> from Jolly Old England Town. his friend impersonate his own voice and call you. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Liz, why don't you like top 40 music? I don't I don't dislike it. There are songs that I like. And, and then, then she, then <laughs> she sings the slightest oh, bit to me, man. and I have to I name mean, name them. one. I'll sing it for you. Despacito. Despacito. <laughs> you got to you come got to, to your senses. senses. <laughs> that was it. You What's another it? one? I know this. I know it. Uh, uh, I'm the one, DJ Khaled. I'm the one. I'm the one. I'm the one. <laughs> there's, there's a new song that I found out about that I've never heard before, but it goes raindrop. Drop top. Uh, yes. I don't know what the song and is, but if you say raindrop on the street, people go drop top. <laughs> yeah, that's all right. It's yeah. like a chant. I, I do that thing where you know I'm walking down the it. street next to you know I, I'd like to prank people, so I'll be like pretending to be talking to my phone or talking to my friend and say something really awkward. Uh-huh. Like when I'm with Liz, I go Jade. We gotta go to the bathroom. We gotta go find Tori at Hollywood Arts. Every time we're in like a, like uh, a Toys R Us. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we'll be like often. Becca Wicks. I'm like Matt. Jane, and then they'll be like, Where's Beck? Oh, where's just Rex? Connected it's it. me, Robbie from Victorious. <laughs> Usually we're in such like a, we're in such a losery place that they'll be like, they would never be here, and so they yeah. don't believe that it's us. Say, why can't you just say you don't like top forty music? You're trying to avoid. No, she saying, does. I don't. But I don't everything think you don't. I like um. <laughs> I like Cat Stevens. Yeah, I love. Like the Stones, I yeah. think it was, I, this, it was yeah. 1968. You, are, you appreciate I like music. Ariana's music. It's yeah. I mean that. The little shorty. Yeah. Quality music. Yes, and I like. Um, I like. I think Bruno Mars is very talented. Okay. Is this? Are you satisfied with? Yeah, the an artist. No. I'm. Just, when, when are we getting a Liz album? Not soon. Uh, Not oh, soon. Why? Um. I don't. You want to write it with me? Like I don't know. You don't want I me to write that. Why? I'm not good at that. Oh. I feel like you you guys could do something together. We wrote a song. We wrote a song. Let's we hear wrote it. two. Mom and her best friend Diane. No, we wrote the other one. Life. Oh, life is hard and, and it doesn't, doesn't get better, better until you meet the boy you love. Boys come, come in all different shapes and sizes. All different ages, ages new, new surprises. surprises. <laughs> Who will I find? Who, Who will, will he be? be? Will he, he have the same age? beard as daddy? <laughs> will his beard tickle when I kiss him? And when he leaves me, will I miss him? Wow. It's a... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I love okay. it. We uh we think- shot a, a short where I play a uh, a young girl named Victory Clark Dugan <laughs> and her and she is uh my mother so Beverly hot. Clark Dugan. <laughs> you get hot in here. <laughs> and uh, that's the song that we sing at the end while we're driving into the sunset. Loved it. Yeah, I, I'm looking I like forward it. to seeing that. It's that's, great. That's really I mean, no album right now. For <laughs> real, <laughs> tears. When I show people, tears in their eyes. Yeah, that, that's how you know. People love it. We did it and spent Dugan. time on it. But we spent a lot. And then people cry because we did that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, hard hidden questions. Go. Uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. You're in pajamas. It's hot in here. We're drinking champagne. Dynasty is coming to CW when? We don't know, right? We don't have a. Do we have a set date where it premieres? It's really funny because every time I come on your show, <laughs> like I. And I said this before. I watch what? other people's interviews, and you're so like, you're go. almost nervous. You're so prepared. You're just so prepared. I came on the show like two years ago for a premiere date, and you messed it up. You didn't get the premiere date right. And I have the premiere date because I, it's my bio on everything. And you could have just looked at one. Okay, so I don't remember it right now. I'm gonna look it up. But like, it's a thing. It's October 11th. I'm gonna have to look at 9 p.m. on the CW after Riverdale. They already know the time. Yeah, 9 p.m. Like October? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I look like a... Bl- yeah. L- Liz uh, nailed that. I look like one of the blind mice from Doesn't Shrek. he? Look yes. like one of the blind mice. Yeah. He sent me a picture. I just sent him back a picture of a blind mouse. And I go, oh, man. With a cane. But I still wear them. He still wears them. LAI works. It's a, it's a cool look. I like it a lot. Merci beaucoup. Yeah, it's How nice. are you doing? What's your life like right now? I mean, there's no no life update. I don't know. Life is going okay, you know? Oh. Just trying to trying to live, show? trying to get by. A little help from your friends. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Some help from the friends. That's good. Yeah, not yeah. It's not bad. Okay, good. Okay, you're gonna move. To, you're going to Atlanta. You're gonna be there for how long? Oh my God, probably like six to nine months. Oh. Whoa. I know. Oh, I'm not gonna get to see you. We see each other so I, I, much. I, I, what am I gonna do? <laughs> what are you gonna do? I see you once a year, and so what is nine months? Is, that really is a long time. So yeah. I, I mean, you you obviously I got a place. You you're gonna live there, but you have a boyfriend here. You have a life here. Your yeah. dogs are here. Yeah, I have like a lot of animals here. Like more more than shippable. Are you, are you gonna bring Otis with you? No. I can't. You know why? I'm not going to. By the way, the last time I was on the show, I was like, I think I'm going to get a puppy. You did. Got it. Did it. Because I do everything I say I'm going to do. <laughs> <laughs> 
So that winked the camera. Yep. <laughs> and uh, so I got that check. I really, so now, no, I'm not going to, hold on. Okay, so yeah, I'm not going to bring Otis because he has such a vibrant life here and he runs around with all the animals and he has so many animal friends. Yeah. I'm not going to like put him in a condo. Okay? Okay, okay, are you worried about the the animals back here in LA? Are you worried about? I'm not worried about them. They have a very capable father yeah. who will take care of them. And how often is the father going to come out to visit you? Father will come out when he can. I'll be out there uh, I'm not a needy little girl. I don't need... I don't need someone constantly there, but I, but I, yes, it would be nice. We all leave when I can. He'll come when he can. Um, cool. I was thinking of getting a prairie dog. Before you judge me, <laughs> let me explain. I, I follow an account. Have I showed you Natsumisu? Yes. Natsumisu. He's so cute. Is that the so hedgehog cute. with the strawberry? Not a hedgehog, no. Oh. He is a prairie dog, and... I don't think that's his name. I, I don't know the whole thing. It's my favorite thing on Instagram right now. And he stands up straight and he goes, ah! and then he eats standing up <laughs> and he's so great. And he just like lays on his owner's stomach. And I feel like that's perfect for me when I work. Uh, <laughs> just a like, prairie like, dog? You know, if someone's like water or like back in the day, like gin, like, you know, when you're like uh, in the middle of a scene, like I can be like, my prairie dog. And so I can just put it on my chest Aww. and I can pet my baby and then it can go back in of course. the garbage or whatever, wherever it lives. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. It'll live in a habitat. You say you do what you say you're gonna do. So yeah, the that the or dog. like a big lizard I can walk around with all day, or like you know those crazy lizards. I can an iguana. An iguana. An iguana. I can lend you my bearded dragon, Puff. Yeah. Okay. He's cool. Okay. You really I have kinda... a bearded dragon named Puff? Well, it's my roommate, but I take care of him because you have she... a roommate. Yeah. Who are you living with? Oh, you've met her. Yeah. My yeah. You did. You've met her, Matt. No, you haven't met her. Oh, sorry. Graham did. Graham's met her like a lot, and he didn't acknowledge it either time. <laughs> I know. Like, uh, I, typical. I mean, yeah. yeah. <laughs> anyway, yeah, we have a, we have a beard of dragon with one arm. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's one arm. Good for you. Good for you. That, that's <laughs> great. That's so, that's so brave of you. <laughs> <laughs> You're so brave. Do you want it? No, I'm okay. okay. I I want something with fur. I really need that for myself. Why don't you get a cat? <gasps> yeah, good. I idea. don't love cats. I have two. They're okay. I will get. I Dita Von Tees has an incredible cat. Oddly enough, you can look it up. What is it? You can look it up. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Okay. You just, uh, what? I don't know, just get get a map in it. <laughs> I, are, just fly I honestly it got. I honestly got a two bedroom condo because I was like, in case Matt will live with me. I'm I'm Matt real Bennett? busy, man. I'm real busy out here. Tough. So it's yeah. kind of tough, but maybe I'll come visit. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I'll make it out to Atlanta to see you. I like it, you know? Oh, you shouldn't ask. <laughs> I shouldn't ask for you to come out. That's okay, but I'll come for, I'll come for a day. Yeah, well, and well, honestly, I, I, see you for a day. I have this killer I'll patio something. that if I throw a futon out there, it's just like that. <laughs> Sleeping under the stars. And that way the smell doesn't get in the house. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Dynasty. Dynasty. October 11th? Mm-hmm. Just, October 11th at 9 p.m. Yeah, October 11th at 9 at 9 p.m. on the uh, CW. On the CW after Riverdale. I mean, you really do have great company on the CW. I mean, it's yeah. a cool network to be on. Yes, it's a cool network to be on. I did a, a promo shoot recently, and I hadn't done one in a while because, like, the promo shoots for Sex and Drugs were like we laid down and they had like fake cocaine all around, and I was like drugs, like drinking, and then there was we had like a the guy who shot like the Rolling Stones shoot us, and then Dynasty's like. Nickelodeon, so I had to like I for, I had to rewire my brain completely, like to be a good person, and like I had to like <laughs> pop a balloon and confetti came out, and I had to like smile. And was this like a, a network wide promotion? Yeah, totally. It was a big network. I, I was I didn't go to the hospital this time, but I had I had pneumonia. What? I'm not well. I don't think I'm doing <laughs> great. I think I'm sick all the time. I, your your stomach has a lot of problems. You, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm. I've, I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's okay. <laughs> yeah, have you How's made- your health? <laughs> it's going okay. Oh, okay. As, as, Biggest <laughs> problem as of late, or you know, to be honest with you, my my thumb shake. <laughs> <laughs> I just realized that you know it's been happening on and off, but then today it happened. Laugh now, for cry a co- later. It for might a be couple something minutes. Really bad. I know. Sorry, I, I didn't I, mean to laugh. Let's cut that out. No, <laughs> does, it, does it shake like this or like this? No, 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 no. no. It like, just, it like almost tremors in your thumbs. Yeah, and it kind of goes. I know. I got to get it checked. Is it out. like a phantom? You want to be like texting? No, no. no. Oh. Actually, that's probably now I'm mad day. that I left. But it could, well, it, it, it could be two things. It could be the fact that like when you hold your cell phone, it is kind of heavy and like you know the, do you the have strain the of the muscles. Plus? Yeah, I do. Seven plus. Seven plus. What, are, what number are we on now? Seven. And I got that, but then it could be something well, I'm else. I'm sorry about that. Oh no, I mean you know it's it's nothing yet. So well, we'll figure it out. I feel bad. Find <laughs> a job that you know they can use fast thumbs. That's that's it. The fastest thumbs. And what about you? Turn into a plus. I'm good. 
<laughs> what about you? I'm doing great. Thank you for asking. Were you nervous at first accepting this role? Because it really is, I mean, it's so famous. It, it, it's known. Yeah, I don't want, I really am, I do not want people to just spot, I, I, like, people love this show and I just don't want them to hate me for what I, I really want to get it right. And, and if I don't get it right, I apologize now. My question Sorry. is like, how do you know if you get it right? Like, is it is is it within you? You know, is the ultimate it- goal is for all for all generations to be happy with what with what we do with yeah. the show. I I'm pretty sure the younger generation will be receptive. I hope so, that they'll like it. It's just to 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 make them happy, the people that grew up with it, so that they get that nostalgic feeling. And so there, a lot of people were like, why couldn't why couldn't we just use the original cast members? There are a couple of reasons. <laughs> they're uh, they're rather old. Some of them, some of them, yeah, some of them. It might be hard. It might be hard to pick up where we left off, but they're... we're gonna do our best. Our writer's incredible. Sal, we have a lot of writers now, but they're, Sally Patrick, who I'm really close with, the writer of our show, is incredible, and she's done a masterful job. And so the far. original creators are involved. Yes, it's they it's are. a husband wife. Yes, they are. That's cool. Yes. And it's obviously super wealth. And the house that you're shooting in Atlanta, I mean, it's like massive. It's like yeah. palatial. It's, it's insane. It was crazy. I We shot there for a few days and I didn't, I never saw the whole house. I mean, you're, you're seeing wealth like that on crazy levels. Like, yeah. How do you, what do you think about it? How do you, how does that make you feel like seeing a house that large or seeing these private jets and all this? I mean, it's kind of gross almost. It's really opulent. It's really, I would never need that much yeah. ever. I like small, I like cozy. So it's fun. It's fun. It's not, I wouldn't, I wouldn't do it, but it's, but I, but it's, I mean, I, I, it's a nice place to shoot. It's not like the the walking dead. We're not in a swamp. It's like we're in a mansion. So it's, I'll take it. It's also like a cool life to, to kind of live. Sure. You know, yeah. not bad. You want a big old house when you can? M- me? Yeah. No. Come on. I don't know. You're going to be like Ryan Seacrest. Uh, You're going to have a barista, a Starbucks barista <laughs> in your basement. <laughs> just chilling, chilling in my basement. Is that a thing? I heard that was a thing. That he has one of those? Mm-hmm. I mean, probably. You know him, Matt. Yeah. No, it's it's like, a, it doesn't just do drinks. She also sure. Perfect, perfect. A she? Food, her name uh, or? What? What's her name? Bernadette. Bernadette. Oh. So oh, like Bernadette! A pri- it's like yes. a private chef. Um, yeah. yeah. Exactly. It's like everybody, everybody's got one. Yeah. <laughs> Duh. Uh, I drove next to him once in, in Beverly Hills. I was in my no Toyota way. Corolla. Oh, baby, that's a sad story. We don't <laughs> tell people that. <laughs> he was in his ass tomorrow. You drive a Toyota oh. Corolla? Yeah, I tried to scream right. from my car I, to hit him I, and One of my me. first, like, little child lovers had, drove a Toyota Corolla. <laughs> Bad memories? One of your child lovers? <laughs> that is bad. <laughs> I mean, I was like 14. I think he was 18. What? what? Yeah. Did I had, like, I made out in a Toyota Corolla a few times. Oh, wow. With, did did oh, you pick you up from the schoolyard? Or? Went to school age. with the kid. Oh, wow. I was I didn't even thought about that in like six years. What's in the champagne? No, I don't. I don't. It's fine. <laughs> the flashback. What color is your Corolla? Have uh, I been in it? You used to have a what's it called? You used to have a Mini, Mini Cooper. Yeah. The, you spent many, many days in the Mini Cooper. Mm. And then you had a Mini Cooper for a second. Mm-hmm. And apparently it was the worst car you've ever been in. That's correct. Yeah. What are you seen. driving nowadays? What was that? <laughs> what are you driving nowadays? Oh, I'd be a little smart ass. That's cute. <laughs> I drive. What do I drive? Ba- ba- it's me insane. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> I don't drive. <laughs> I can't. I, I don't need to. Yeah, yeah. I'll be Should driven. I'll be driven in Atlanta. I, I don't. I'll think be you driven. Sh- should drive. Yeah. I had a couple of questionable. Uh, <laughs> I do. I do Lyft now. By the way, I don't do Uber, for two but reasons. We, one, because I was like, oh, with the whole thing, I was like, I'm not going to take Uber anymore. Look at me. I'm so making a difference. However, then Uber just didn't. They always said no cars available for Lyft. <laughs> <laughs> do you know that? Yes, I do. Dude, like, Wait. like Michael would request my boyfriend requested one, and it was like twenty cars, Lux. <laughs> VIP helicopter <laughs> all right outside. Did you check your rating? I must be low because it they've they've cut me off. Can we do that right now? Give me. Uh, I can. Do you know how to do it? Yeah. It might work, but I'm telling you, it hasn't been working. What, that's. I mean, so I do lift now. I just want to know what your rating is. Yeah. Like I. Oh, I, oh, I can find out. Yeah, they tell you. <sighs> this I'm is scared. <laughs> this is exciting. This is not fair though because my I take them so much that my average must be. You know, you take four <laughs> Ubers a year and four people like you. Cool. Multiply that by you know. 300 people don't like me and 700 people do that's how many I'm taking yeah, uh, I'm not a, I'm not a mathematician but that's close to the numbers seems right a lot of money excuse me it's a lot of money maybe I'm making it no. shut up <laughs> <laughs> it's a lot of money he's, roasting you. <laughs> he's, being he's being fresh he always is you wore like the hot guy white tee today you're I always like, wear the white tee. Oh. In a warm pajamas. But thank you for calling me the hot guy. I appreciate that. No, I, I said you were wearing the hot guy white tee. Like that's the brand of the shirt. 
That's a lot cool. of people want you to give them a spanking. That was a rather large yeah, yeah. Twitter Oh, yeah, post. I was on some trip last year where I was like, I have to be good and I can't do these things. That's fine. If you want to come over here, Matt, and I will take care of a cheek each. <laughs> a cheek each? Do you want to go? <laughs> keep me out of it. I don't <laughs> It's fine. I have to keep do these you hands not, soft Do you not, supple. like, do... Uh, when was the last time, like, you got a little, like, kiss on the lips? I'm a virgin, Liz. That's a lie. Okay. Um, when was the last time? Why'd this flip on me? Uh, she's asking. You're being very. You're calling attention to yourself, so I'm giving you the attention <laughs> no, I that wasn't. you want. I think you were. Just answer the question. Uh, a little, uh, you know. Aww. A little rinky dink. A little rinky <laughs> dink. <laughs> When's the last time someone gave you a little rinky dink? Listen, I'm not here to answer questions, so you're oh. getting nothing out of me. Well, then ask one. Do your job. <laughs> <laughs> I've asked plenty. Okay. Okay. Here's what we learned. Dynasty okay. is going to be. Uh, no, you're going to get it this time. I'm not telling you. When is it coming? Dynasty, October 11th. It's mm-hmm. going to be on nine o'clock, right after Riverdale on the CW. You're going to be gone in Atlanta for nine whole months. A victorious finale. It's a little bit more concrete than in times in the past. I think so. We've learned that. That's big. Uh, your sister, or your 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 mom and your brother do not sleep together. Uh, what else did we learn? Um, Why do we have to learn? The that? Gillies really respect you, <laughs> and the fact that you're even introducing this topic uh, into the it's, it's I love it's I'm sad I feel really bad that like you just told me you for don't the feel fir- anything you're a sociopath <laughs> <laughs> you feel nothing Zach you don't care ah uh, dynasty watch it on the CW um please <laughs> Liz Gillies how do you feel about this conversation I feel like this was I think it's hard because every time so weird but this was the weirdest interview by a landslide <laughs> a little bit. is that okay though I feel really weird I'm, <laughs> I, I'm weirded out by it all I really this I and I'm so proud of you and I always say that like I'm not trying to be mushy because it's not going to go past that but I'm proud of you and I, this studio is definitely it's it, they just get better and better and more and more professional I am the most in, uncomfortable in this <laughs> present studio I've been in like four now I think you've been in all of them there, there hasn't been a studio you I haven't been in. I miss Goom. Me too. Whatever happened Goom, to Goom Radio. I miss that too. I mean, God, you wouldn't come up the freaking elevator. You wanted to walk up the stairs. That was crazy, though. That you were up 30th. high. 30 30 floor. Thing to do. 36. 36. When you're on an elevator with Liz, jump. <laughs> such, a, <laughs> such a rude, so rude. Uh, what other fears do you have? Weather, tornadoes? Weather, airplanes, tornadoes. Turbulence. Weather. Um, turbulence. Oh, my Flying God. The, the worst thing for you. I flew in a tiny little airplane to. Um, afraid of gluten. <laughs> not afraid of gluten. Not afraid of gluten. some spices. I don't Spice. do. Well, I want to do. I'm dying to do that show, Hot Ones. Mm, so good. But I haven't had anything, even like a mild salsa, in like ten years. Oh, you're gonna cry. No, I'm not gonna. I can't do it. But how funny would it be if I can just get through it? It would be so funny. <laughs> you should try. I'm a huge fan of the show. Why don't you? Because I don't know what's gonna happen to me. I mean, it's weird. But that's the point. I mean, you know, you get in not knowing, and then you got to experience it. I guess I'm just scared. Don't be afraid of the unknown, Liz. <laughs> I guess I'm just scared. <laughs> <laughs> Dynasty on the CW, and I. I I'm when no- is it again? October 11th, what 9 time, o'clock. If I'm just like curious. Nine, 9 o'clock? 9 o'clock. What's it after? After Riverdale. Okay. And uh, <laughs> I, I'm really excited for the show, and I congratulate you. Like, at times a thousand, it's uh, it's such an incredible character for you to play. Found it, You guys are, it's like you're perfect. And it's yeah. all, you know, <laughs> Do you want an Oscar for that performance? I don't buy anything you're doing right now. I feel like you don't respect me. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, no. That was that was an aggressive action. <laughs> oh, that, right? Taking aggressive, aggressive movements. You, right you threw a pen at me. <laughs> Look at him desperately trying to wrap it up. Or his hands got too sweaty and they just. They're, it's all. They, they're, or the thumbs. They're always sweaty. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna give you my diagnosis, my thumb diagnosis. Oh. Can, you, can you see a thumb doctor? I emailed my stomach doctor last night, just telling him what happened this week and ugh, like what we went through, like your stomach that you look after and I, and and he and he writes back, what do you want me to do? <laughs> And I was like, oh, fix it? <laughs> you know when you think someone's like totally, it's like if I was like talking to Matt and he's just like, why do you think I care about your problems? And I was like, because you've always pretended to. <laughs> just really threw me off guard. Anyway. Dynasty. Thanks. On the CW. Yes. Thanks for coming by. Oh. <laughs> Thanks for having me. Thanks for having me and my service animal. Good job, Liz. <laughs>